what's up y'all this has been my current art style right now i'm doing these collages um and it's kind of fun it's almost um because it allows me to work so much faster you know i'm in canva of course um and trust me i didn't think i'd be using canva to make art either even though it literally is called canva which is canvas without an s but anyway um so anyway, so what I do is I start with, you go see the, this is my Inception series of art. If you go see the other ones, um, you know, you can kind of see what the idea is. But I start with something cool as a background. I'm trying to think of something right now. I've done ice, I've done water, I've done dirt. Doesn't sound that interesting. I've done a cottage. Um... In this in this style of art I'm really trying to focus on what really sort of speaks to me in a moment so um, try to think of something try to think of something what would be cool what what is speaking to me what is it saying Ooh, I got an idea I don't like it that much though. Um, let's do let's do a street. One problem with streets to me sometimes. I got the Canva Pro subscription. Is that you know we think we like streets a lot, but how, you don't really want to be on the street. You know, that's why it's like it's a negative thing to be so like, oh, he's from the street or, you know, like, he, he, you know, the streets. No one says it in a good way. You might say it to add grit to who you are, but you're not really saying, oh, I, I like the streets. Let's see a park. I did a forest, but that was the problem with that is I'd have to find a really good photo because trees can be really busy. Trees can be really busy. You know, what I'm thinking a lake. Sometimes I do solid stuff, sometimes I do actual photos. I started just doing solid stuff like gold and some of the backgrounds. This one's kind of cool. Let me see what's going on there. Nah. I think it's going to get more high res, but I'm not really feeling it anyway. Um, oh, you know what I'm feeling right now? Golden Gate Bridge. I want a, a really nice, yeah what I'm feeling right here. Hopefully this is super high res because I'm going to only be taking uh, okay. Well, there you can see one of the ones I did right before this one. Okay, problem here is that this thing's a little bit too wide. I don't want it to be weird in case I need to go in case I need to go back into it. So let's get what we want out of this right now. Crop function. Uh, Could have refined it down more, but I want a little bit of room to play. All right, and then my borders. The border on this one, it's not really high res enough for what I'm trying to do. No, can't do that. It's not gonna. It's not gonna. Good down in the long run. This one's better and much more of a vibe. This is much less typical Golden Gate Bridge than I would think. The problem with this one, and you're getting my process on here, is I think it might be a little bit too. Was this one I had before? Ooh, I like this one. See, this one's a little bit. This photo's really good. You know, this one's more about the photo. I don't really want to be. The only thing is, this one just looks low res. I might take it anyway though, because I'm vibing. I don't know. That's pretty high resolution. Yeah, I'm catching this one's vibe. I am catching this one's vibe, and that's what it's about with these collages. It's like, yo, catch the vibe. First off, first off. Let's go up here with it. 
drag it to fill the space. We're going to leave a little bit on top because what we're going to do is send it back. I know there's uh, people out there who use Photoshop like, I can't be, shh, dude's a faker, can't even use, can't even use Photoshop. No, that's not what I'm doing right now. And I never really got into Photoshop like that, to be honest. Okay, so now we think about the overlay. I got the background vibe settled in. I'm really enjoying this one. Um, I feel like going pink paint. Sometimes I know what I want to do, sometimes I don't. This one. We don't have enough, we don't have enough options here for me. Mm, not enough options. Let me see if I like this one or not. Nope, get out of here. Be gone. You know what I'd be down for? I'd be down for orange paint, even though it's going to set up an uphill battle for me. Okay, they don't have anything anyway. Oh, you know what? I forgot. I forgot the graphics for this, too. Let's go back to pink paint. This pink would be perfect right here. If I can get... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is perfect. That's what I'm talking about. You know what I love about this is this says to you pink paint. There's a couple other good ones here, too. I might, I might take two, but this is just the perfect visual. So now it's setting the balance of it right and still not missing anything i want i like this there's nothing there anyway leaves me the cars which i like um a lot of the other pieces have the diamond in it you know the inception diamond i'm not gonna oh this one's good too oh okay we got a themeology here i have to flip this oh yeah Oh yeah, we're getting somewhere now. We are getting somewhere. Boom, boom. Okay. This doesn't need a lot more touches. This does not need a lot more touches for what I'm going for. I know it's a very quick thing. Some people, I'm sure, they're gonna say, "Oh, it doesn't count. That's not art. You're just, you're just moving stuff around." No matter what, you're just moving stuff around. If I had a paintbrush in my hand, you know. See, I think the paintbrush is almost, and I paint, you know. I got I got dozens of paintings around me right now. Um, but paint, that records all of your movement, up and down, all that kind of stuff. This is a little bit of a challenge because you're only seeing the placement. What is my involvement? You can't see where I move things around. Anyway. I, it's, I'm not trying to prove anything. I'm, I'm just trying to make things at this point that I find visually stunning that didn't exist before. If someone was, if I thought someone was just going to make this one day and I wouldn't have to do anything, then fine, I don't have to make it. But if, if it wasn't going to come about, then I think my involvement is merited. I'm going to rotate that boy a little bit. I like that. I like that. Um, now how do I want to finish it? Now, how do I want to complete it? It's almost done. But I think one really strong addition to it could really send it over the moon. Come on. That's what I love about this. So right now, if you went to you know my my group on Patreon, American, um, and you joined my live painting thing, this is actually what live art making. This is what we would be doing because I'm not really painting right now. Unless someone was like, oh, I really wanted to learn how to paint then, because I don't mind painting, obviously. But anyway, uh, let's see. Let's see. What's the right Final vibe. You know, I'm thinking something right here. I'm thinking something right here. I think we gotta bring out the Inception Diamond. I mean, it's really just the um, the Canva Diamond. Cause they're the ones who have made this graphic in here. Oh, where is it? Um, I never even thought about the fact that it like might not be here one day. Oh. I've never seen this one before. 
What? Is this new? I'm using this one. This is like a straight side view. to turn the diamonds upside down because I feel like that's more natural. I don't know why. That's kind of a me thing. Like this one, I'm thinking I want to go multiple smaller ones. Sometimes I do the very big one to make a statement, but this one I'm feeling more is better. Sometimes I don't like to include the diamonds anymore because I find diamonds to be impersonal um, and not very human-like at all. But that turned out really well really fast. I did not expect that. Um, but in some ways I think they can be in the right context. So you'll notice in the if you look at some of the ones I've been making, I haven't been um, in the last, because there's about 40 of these so far. Um, this is really good. This is done. This is done. Um, stay tuned for the next one. This one's done, though. 